Welcome to our channel, CSP. Today we're exploring the different types of scaffolds used in construction. Scaffolding is an essential part of any building project, and choosing the right type can make a big difference in terms of safety and efficiency. In this video, we'll be taking a closer look at the most common types of scaffolds and what they're best suited for. Whether you're an HSE, construction worker, DIY enthusiast, or just curious about the industry, this video is a must-watch. So sit back, relax, and let's dive into the world of scaffolding. Tube and Coupler Scaffolding Tube and Coupler Scaffolding is a type of scaffolding that is made up of steel tubes and various types of couplers, which are used to connect the tubes together. This type of scaffolding is versatile and can be used in a variety of construction projects, including building construction, bridge construction, and industrial maintenance. The couplers used in tube and coupler scaffolding can be fixed, swivel, or putlog, depending on the specific application. The tubes used in this type of scaffolding come in various sizes and lengths, allowing the scaffolding to be customized to fit the specific needs of the project. Tube and coupler scaffolding is known for its strength, durability, and versatility, and is a popular choice for many construction projects. H-Frame Scaffolding H-frame scaffolding is a type of scaffolding that is made up of a series of H-shaped frames that are connected by cross braces. The frames are usually made of steel or aluminum and are designed to be easily assembled and disassembled. The cross braces are used to stabilize the scaffolding and prevent it from swaying or collapsing. H-frame scaffolding is commonly used for smaller construction projects, such as home renovations or small commercial projects. It is also often used for maintenance work, such as painting or cleaning, and is popular with DIY enthusiasts because of its ease of use and affordability. H-frame scaffolding is known for its strength and stability, and is a safe and reliable choice for many construction and maintenance projects. Masonry Scaffolding Masonry scaffolding is a type of scaffolding that is specifically designed for masonry work, such as bricklaying or stone masonry. It typically consists of a platform that is supported by brackets that are attached to the wall, and is used to provide a safe and stable work surface for masons and other workers. The brackets are usually made of steel or aluminum and are designed to fit securely onto the wall without damaging it. Masonry scaffolding is often used in the construction of buildings, walls, and other structures that require masonry work. It is typically more stable and secure than other types of scaffolding, and is designed to withstand the weight and force of heavy masonry materials. It is an important tool for masonry workers, and is essential for ensuring their safety and productivity on the job. Cantilever Scaffolding Cantilever scaffolding is a type of scaffolding that is used when the ground beneath the scaffolding cannot support the weight of the scaffolding. It is commonly used in building construction, particularly for high-rise buildings. Cantilever scaffolding is designed to be attached to the side of a building, using support beams or anchor points that are fixed to the structure. The scaffolding platform extends out from the building, supported by cantilevered beams that are anchored to the building's structure. This allows workers to access the building's exterior without having to rely on ground-based scaffolding. It is typically more complex and expensive than other types of scaffolding, and requires specialized expertise to install and operate safely. However, it is an essential tool for many high-rise construction projects, and is often the only viable option for accessing the upper levels of tall buildings. Suspended Scaffolding Suspended scaffolding is a type of scaffolding that is hung from the roof or another high point using ropes or chains. It is commonly used for maintenance work or construction on tall buildings or other structures, such as bridges or dams. Suspended scaffolding can be either powered or manually operated, and can be designed to accommodate one or more workers at a time. The scaffolding platform is typically made of steel or aluminum and is suspended from the roof or high point using a series of pulleys and ropes or chains. Suspended scaffolding is often used for tasks such as window washing, painting, or repairs, and provides workers with a safe and stable work surface that is easily maneuverable. It's often used in conjunction with other types of scaffolding, such as tube and coupler scaffolding or cantilever scaffolding, to provide access to hard-to-reach areas of a building or structure. It requires specialized training and expertise to operate safely, and is subject to strict safety regulations to ensure the safety of workers and the public. Rolling Scaffolding Rolling scaffolding, also known as mobile scaffolding or tower scaffolding, is a type of scaffolding that is designed to be easily moved from one location to another. 
It typically consists of a platform supported by a series of vertical frames that are mounted on casters or wheels. The casters allow the scaffolding to be easily moved around a worksite, making it a popular choice for projects that require frequent repositioning of the scaffolding. Rolling scaffolding is often used for tasks such as painting, plastering, or electrical work, where workers need to move around a worksite quickly and efficiently. It is typically made of lightweight materials, such as aluminum or fiberglass, and is designed to be easy to assemble and disassemble. Rolling scaffolding is subject to strict safety regulations, including requirements for stability and fall protection, to ensure the safety of workers and others on the worksite. Trestle scaffolding Trestle scaffolding is a type of scaffolding that is typically used for smaller construction projects, such as home repairs or renovations. It consists of a series of trestles or tripods that support a platform, usually made of wooden planks or boards. The trestles are adjustable and can be moved up or down to accommodate changes in the level of the ground or the height of the work being done. Trestle scaffolding is typically lightweight and easy to assemble and disassemble, making it a popular choice for DIY projects or small construction jobs. It is also relatively inexpensive compared to other types of scaffolding, making it accessible to a wide range of users. Bamboo scaffolding Bamboo scaffolding is a type of scaffolding that is commonly used in Asian countries, particularly in China, Hong Kong, and other Southeast Asian countries. It is made primarily of bamboo poles and nylon straps, and is used for a wide range of construction projects, from small buildings to high-rise structures. Bamboo scaffolding is lightweight, flexible, and relatively inexpensive, making it a popular choice for construction projects in areas where bamboo is readily available. It is also eco-friendly and sustainable, as bamboo is a renewable resource that grows quickly and requires minimal processing. Despite its lightweight and flexible nature, bamboo scaffolding is known for its strength and stability, and is capable of supporting heavy loads and multiple workers at once. It requires specialized skills and knowledge to assemble and operate safely, and is subject to strict safety regulations to ensure the safety of workers and the public. Steel Scaffolding Steel scaffolding is a type of scaffolding that is made primarily of steel tubes and fittings. It is commonly used in large construction projects, particularly for high-rise buildings, bridges, and other structures where high strength and stability are required. Steel scaffolding is typically assembled using a tube and coupler system, which consists of steel tubes that are connected together using couplers or clamps. The scaffolding platform is typically made of wooden planks or steel decking, and is supported by the steel tubes and fittings. Steel scaffolding is known for its strength, durability, and stability, and is capable of supporting heavy loads and multiple workers at once. It is also resistant to fire, corrosion, and other environmental hazards, making it a safe and reliable option for construction projects. Steel scaffolding requires specialized training and expertise to assemble and operate safely, and is subject to strict safety regulations to ensure the safety of workers and the public. So there you have it, the different types of scaffolds used in construction projects. Each type of scaffold has its unique features and benefits, and it's important to choose the right one for the job. Whether you're a seasoned construction professional or just starting out, we hope that you found this video informative and helpful. Thanks for watching, and be sure to subscribe to our channel for more great content.